I mean, if the other two or other party members are watching it, I mean, why do I have to watch it? Doesn't seem necessary. Alright, a clear image. The image is clear and sharp. Hello, dear viewers. It's time for Bad Bad Bathhouse. Uh -huh. Tonight I'll introduce a superb sight for those searching for sublime love that surpasses the separation of the sexes. Uh -uh. I'm your host, Kanji Tatsumi, serving you this scandalously special sneak in report. Uh -uh. Goodness gracious, just imagine the things that might happen to me there. Woo well then, let's get this show on the road. Toodaloo! Uh... <laughs> it really was Kanji. Huh? Uh, oh yeah, you're right. What in the world was that? But damn it, it's just what we were afraid of. Huh, yeah. If only we'd held our ground and stayed there a little longer. <sighs> in any case, that place that was behind him, what do you think it is? A superb sight for those searching for sublime love? I just don't get it. Hmm. Anyways, we better hurry and come up with a plan tomorrow. Okay, yeah. Talk, talk, talk. <sighs> Given the pattern so far, Kanji's already inside the TV. Yep. I wonder what the Midnight Channel really is. Hmm. At first I thought it was one of those paranormal things, but when I gave it a try, it it was real. Turns out it's actually connected to another world. If there's a rumor going around, that means a bunch of people are watching it. How did the rumor go? If you stare into a turned off TV on a rainy night. No one in their right mind would try something that ridiculous, don't you think? Unless someone urged them to. But if you actually try, it does work. And not just once. If this rumor spreads and everyone starts watching the Midnight Channel... It could cause a huge panic. Uh, yeah. If Teddy is right, the missing people themselves create the stuff we see. So it's not random. It's specifically related to whoever goes missing. Yukiko had a show too, but she doesn't remember doing anything like that. The shadow. Jeez. Um, this might be a little off subject, but the culprit is probably watching the shows that come on, right? No doubt. He's probably sitting back and enjoying... Wait a sec, I bet he is enjoying it. He's probably laughing his head off watching the show that comes on after he throws people into the TV. Oh, I get it. Yeah, it's definitely possible. Mm. Ugh. Now when I think of the killer, I get this image of a total sicko. I want to see everything about you, Yuki-chan. Uh... So if people saw Yukiko's show, do you think people were watching what happened to me, too? Oh, that is it! That killer is dead meat! 
I'm gonna leave footprints all over his face. Hmm. Guys! First we save Kanji, then we crush the killer. Yep. Finally we crush the killer and send him to hell. Got it? All right. Uh, I've grown nothing more. Okay. <laughs> oh, there she goes again. Chie, those last two were the same thing. Ah, <sighs> uh, I know. Yukiko, Yukiko, sigh. <laughs> Teddy! Teddy! Hey, Teddy, someone's here, right? Yep. Oh, yep, I think someone's here. You think? Uh, do you know where he is? I don't know. We think it's a boy named Kanji. Doesn't help. I don't know. Oh, he's kind of sad. Hmm, what's wrong? Not feeling well? Well, I sniff and I sniff, but I still can't tell where the smell comes from. Oh. Aren't you thinking too much about too many things? I mean, last time you were wondering about who you really are and how long you've been here. Your head's empty to begin with, dude. Don't stress out over stuff too much. <laughs> You're right. Oh, Teddy. Whoa, he's seriously down about this. If you can't figure out where Kanji is, we're in deep trouble. We can't just wander around aimlessly in a place like this. I guess we should ask his mother. I know what might help. You should give me a clue about this kanji person. It's just a feeling I have. I think I could concentrate better with it. Do you have anything that could give me a good understanding of him? Something about kanji, huh? I can't really think of anything besides all the rumors about him. Yeah, it's not like we know him that well. I just need some sort of hint. Something that tells me what he's really like. Why don't we ask around and find people who know Kanji-kun personally? Oh. Uh, yeah. About Kanji. But you decide to ask around town about Kanji. Okay. Um... I guess we should we should ask his mother. That seems like a big yes, yes. Oh, yeah. Go. Mother, mother, mother. Oh, goes okay. Hey, how's it going on your end? Ba ba ba. No one wants to ask his mother. Really? Ah, are you here to ask about Kanji too? Sheesh. I wonder where he's wandered off to now. He's always like this. So I'm gonna talk to him about <clears throat> oh, Sorry about that, folks. Oh, my game just crashed. <laughs> Weird. First time for, uh, for that, I guess. I've already talked to Kanji. Can be a small boy from before. Hmm. Yep. Search for the boy. Sounds like an excellent idea. Um. He 
he wouldn't be in the shop in this stream. Would he be at the school? Or maybe it's the San Miguel River. at school. I don't know. Nah, I don't think he's here. Nah, maybe he said the... Is there usually someone in here? I don't know. Ah, he looks probably wearing a hat. Ah, I guess I've seen him. He's... Tomorrow. Okay. Alright. Since I have the whole day, might as well... Um... What should I do? Maybe go to music music class. Is that on Wednesdays? I don't know. Some materials to build a new Dowsing Rod. 